What happened here? They killed everyone. Look for the blade of the forbidden forest. It was um, very rewarding uh, to, uh, as far as my experiences, to watch everything unfold and actually see the pages of your story, you know, come to life. That's uh, one of the most rewarding things as an artist uh, to see as all these characters kind of unfold and then mesh into each other and the story uh, being brought to life uh, has, you know, the beginning, a middle, and an end. Uh, so yeah, that was uh, very, very cool. What is this? A woman? <laughs> As a woman, she was raised to become a warrior, but essentially she never knew anything about her past. And I think as part of a journey, she's, she's, she's going to discover who she really is and what her real purpose is. And that's nothing I can't handle. Saga for me was inspired by a combination of all of the strong warrior women that I have in my life. Um, I also like to use a lot of animal imagery when I do work, so I pulled a lot from cats and snakes for her. <sighs> you wish to be delivered to your death! King Golf is a barbarian, and uh, I basically just thought about a primitive, so almost caveman-like uh, person, sort of a Norwegian version of a caveman, in, in essence, is the way I portrayed Ingolf, and a uh, very guttural speech and all that. So, you have come to fulfill the prophecy. The prophecy? You bear the mark? You are the only one to escape? Inspiration for this role um, was the Norse gods, Frigg and Freya, as well as the Norns. And I also took some of my own personal practices uh, within religion. Look for the blade of the forbidden forest. The one you seek will not speak to men. I think they're going to be drawn into the fantasy of it and it will carry them through till the end. And it's a very exciting script, um, extremely well done, and uh, it's a great, it's a great short film. What is this? A woman? <laughs> Your best sword. Think he's bigger than a bear? A grizzly, maybe. The sense of power is what I want people to take away from this is don't ever underestimate someone that think might have a weakness or might be, you know, not as talented because uh, in the end you, you could be wrong. I knew this day was going to be exciting.